My next guest this morning, he is visiting us from California. He's one of the authors that you'll find published through absolutely amazing ebooks. To give you a little background on him, he's worked for major advertising agencies in both New York and LA. And now along with being an author, he's a commercial pilot and a saxophone player. Before he plays the saxophone for us this morning, we'll talk about his latest novel entitled A Loose Knot. Bob, thank you so much for being here. Well, thank you for having me. And actually, you don't have your saxophone with you. No, so. <laughs> no, 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 your listeners and viewers will be thankful for that. <laughs> I don't know about that. Yeah. I think that we would enjoy hearing mm. you play. Maybe the next time. Okay, I'll here pause. In okay. How was your visit this time? Well, it, right now it's wet because uh, it does rain in Key West, and it's mm. uh, proven that. Right, yeah. right. Unfortunately, you're kind of here during a, a rainy week. I promise it's sunny, though, most of the well, time. Well, I'll come back then. <laughs> All right, Bob, I mentioned that you have a book out through Absolutely Amazing eBooks, and the title is A Loose Knot. Tell us a little bit about this book. Well, it's a story about a guy in advertising who is uh, in Miami on business, and uh, he gets a phone call that his ex-wife has been uh, found dead. And the next thing he knows, uh, our LAPD cop is knocking on the door uh, with some questions that he can't uh, very uh, truthfully answer. So um, he runs and uh, becomes uh, uh, a fugitive in uh, Key West. He heads down here and uh, finds himself uh, broke, homeless, and uh, living by his wits. But uh, he uh, is taken in by some of the strange, wonderful, quirky characters that you find here, and starts a, a new life, but still trying to stay under the uh, radar because the investigation is continuing in uh, L.A. And so the action shifts between uh, Key West, what's going on with Jack Hunter, who is the protagonist of the story, and the investigation in uh, uh, L.A. Uh, until it's resolved. Mm -hmm. and I uh, won't tell the ending. Okay, yeah. well it sounds very, very intriguing. Now you mentioned that your main character, he's, an a he's in the advertising mm -hmm. world. You were in the advertising world. Yeah. Are you guys kind of, is this character have some of your traits in him? Uh, well, I, I guess so, but uh, I, I didn't intend that. You know, <laughs> the advertising part, but actually uh, my side of it was creative and his is in uh, television production, kind of like yours. Okay, and thankfully you haven't found out that your wife was dead. No, 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 not at all. <laughs> <laughs> now is this your first book that yes, you've it, completed? Yes, it, it really is, and it was a long time coming out. Actually, uh, I worked on this thing for, I don't know, eight years at least, uh, and uh, you know, you, it's just hard to get somebody to read it. Uh, that's a, one of the tough things about um, unknown authors, and uh, because you have to get an agent, and you can't get an agent because uh, they're in business too, they're, they're on a living. And uh, so, fortunately, I, I saw an article on uh, Cheryl Rhodes and um, absolutely amazing um, e-books, and uh, and he said in the article that uh, uh, he would read things from unknowns, uh, and and that's terrific because he d he did read it, and it's not a vanity press or anything like that. But he he read it, and uh, to my uh, eternal thankfulness and surprise, he said uh, they they liked it, mm -hmm. and uh, so then uh, they published it, and mm -hmm. uh, and I haven't gotten over it yet. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think it is just wonderful, Bob, and you have a second book that will also be out coming very soon through Absolutely Amazing e -books. Yes, it, its uh, working title right now is A, uh, a Deadly uh, Deception. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, it also has some interesting characters in it. Mm -hmm. yeah. So another mystery thriller type yes, book? Yes, yeah, it's a mystery, mm -hmm. yeah. So it sounds like that's your favorite type of writing then? Yeah, well, it's, it's, it's a start anyway, and, uh, and, and it's kind of fun. Writing, writing is fun because you, you have control of it, at least for a while, creatively. And, uh, and then the characters have a way of taking you to places that you really didn't know that you were going. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and so I, I enjoy it. Uh, it's, it's always exciting. It's not easy, but it's, it's fun. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. Well, I'm glad that you've released two books now, almost. The second almost. one's almost out, yeah. and that's you're down here in Key West with us 
thank you for being on the show with me this morning, Bob. Well, well, thank you for having me. I look forward to hearing from you the next time that you're in Key West. Okay, <laughs> and I'll, I'll bring the saxophone. It sounds good. Okay. All right, thank you everybody for tuning in this morning. I hope that you have a great rest of your day and you can join me back here tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. and back at 8.30 a.m. Take care. If I